I'm going to do this. I have a hard time talking about myself. I have a much easier time celebrating amazing startup founders and all the work that they do. But, you know, I just I tend to get a little nostalgic this time of year. Uh, for those of you who don't know, 17 years ago, I was inspired by startups in Portland. And so I just sat down and started writing about those founders and those startups, people in the community I was talking to. And it wasn't, it wasn't very good writing. <laughs> it definitely wasn't journalistic writing. But I was passionate about it. And I was willing to be bad at it to get the opportunity to pursue that passion. And I think that's, that's the reason I'm recording this, talking about me, as awkward and uncomfortable and bad as it is, because I just want to encourage you that if you have something you're passionate about, if you have something you want to try or do, regardless of the potential outcomes, I not only want you to start doing that thing, whether it's an Instagram account or writing online or maybe a YouTube channel or a podcast or painting or drawing or taking photos. I don't care what it is. It, it could even be pursuing that startup idea that you had. But regardless of what it is that you choose to pursue, Give yourself permission to be bad at it for a very, very long time. Because I never really had a plan in place when I sat down and started writing. And yet, the amazing opportunities, the people I've met, the companies I've gotten the chance to work with, everybody from Widening Kennedy to Coca-Cola, Nike, Intel, Daimler, Autodesk, Adidas. So many amazing companies, opportunities. Like I even got the chance to do a TED talk simply because I sat down and started typing into the internet late one night without much talent. And if someone like me can accidentally stumble into something like that simply because I'm passionate about it, then I'm convinced if you pursue your passion, give yourself permission to be bad at it while you're learning. In fact, I encourage you <laughs> to be bad at it while you're learning. I, arguably, I'm still bad at it <laughs> even after 17 years of practice. I encourage you to pursue that passion, to just start, and to keep going. Because you owe it to yourself, and I believe that you'll come up with something amazing. <laughs>